Hey guys, welcome to my bullet journal flip through for 2018. I know I haven't done a voiceover in a long time, but then again, I never really know what to talk about in voiceovers. That's why I guess I never really do them. So in the beginning of 2018, I bullet journaled mostly the conventional way with like keys and daily to-do list and stuff like that. But then towards the middle and end of the year, I really just use my journal for the most random crap ever. Song lyrics, journal entries, collections, all kinds of stuff. Oh, okay, this is one of my favorite spreads actually because first of all, I actually made decent drawings, which is pretty rare. And second of all, it was my birthday week, so nice. I just really liked how this spread turned out. Here's a spread I really liked that I made with lyrics from the song King by Laura Aguilera. So I guess I'll talk about why I stopped doing the to-do list format. So in making these spreads, yes they looked nice and I had fun making them, but they took up lots of time to make, which is the exact opposite of what a to-do list should be doing, which is saving time. And as school got busier and busier, I really didn't have time to make these like complex spreads. And I found that writing them on a scrap piece of paper or just on the notes app on my phone was a lot more effective. And so after I realized this, my bullet journal became more of a collection of ideas and things I was interested in. Sometimes I would try to go back to the conventional way, but then it wouldn't really work out well, and I would just go back to using the journal as a random mishmash of things that I was interested in. In the later part of the year especially, I used it as a journal to keep track of the things I did, the things I experienced, and things I learned. Hope you guys enjoyed my flip through and I'll see you in 2019.